Oh my gosh, Jade, I'm so sorry. I, I swear I didn't know they were going to do that. And I'm so sorry for treating you like... No, for letting the people who I thought were my friends treat you like that. I swear. I hey, there, it's okay. I forgive you. It was just... I guess it was just so difficult being the new girl here and Alex on those guys just seemed so cool, you know? And I just really wanted to be a part of that. And now that I think about it, I don't think we were ever really friends. If we were ever really comfortable with each other, you know? Hey, what about Brianna? Oh, uh, she just needs a little time. It's been the four of us since the beginning of the year, and even though she's not completely happy, she's not ready to give up all that. Yeah, I get it. But hey, it's all onwards and upwards from here, okay? Yeah. I think I've lost myself a little since I've gotten here, and I'm sorry I ended up treating you like crap. Jeez, a bunch of girls just locked you in a supply closet, and I'm talking your ear off about my problems? Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm really fine. I mean, at first I was a little freaked out, but it turns out I needed some time with myself to sort some things out. Plus, I think better when I'm alone, and with my imagination, of course. <laughs> I'm just so surprised by you. You seem so free from what other people think, I mean. Oh shoot, that's English. I'm freaking out about this presentation. Hey, I'm pretty sure we go by last name. So you either go tomorrow or Friday. Okay. And hey, we can go over the slides sometime if you want. I might take you up on that. Hey Jade? Yep? Can we start over? Of course, I'd like that. Again, I'm so sorry for treating you like that. I feel so bad when I'm right hey, about it. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Sure. Yeah, I promise. Okay. Okay. Hey, Teacher's Pet. Miss Remy's late again. You gonna go do what Teacher's Pets do best? So do you want to do the presentation? Time? Teacher's Pet, she's talking to you. Hey, Teacher's Pet. You know what? I feel really bad for you both. Excuse me? Yeah, I feel bad that you had to resort to locking me in a supplies closet just so that you could feel good about yourself. We didn't do that, what? <laughs> Whatever. Look, I'm not gonna care about what you think of me. You never took the time to get to know me, so why should I care? Yeah, and seriously, lay off her. She's never done anything to you. Whatever. Hey, not bad for a teacher's bet. Sorry, old habits die hard. <laughs> it's okay. Hey, where are you going? I'm gonna go do what teacher pets do best. But first, there's someone I have to talk to. Hey. Hey. So, thanks for the sparalyzer again. I'll probably return it sometime tonight. I didn't realize we were neighbors. Yeah, me neither. Um, sorry if I acted a little weird. I just, yeah, I wasn't expecting that. It's cool that we are, though. Oh, totally. Um, we can work on English together and stuff. And math, too. Right, math. Uh, so, what did you want to talk to me about? So, you know about the winter dance next week? Um, yeah, yeah, my dad's organizing the snacks. Cool. So, I'll be going, as in me, myself, as a person, one person, going to the winter dance. Uh, are you? Um, probably. I, I don't really know where it is, though. Oh, my mom organized an event there once, so I know how to get there. Oh. Maybe you could show me how to get there. Maybe we could go there together. Since, you know, we're neighbors. Yeah, absolutely. So, we could go there together as in two individuals, two people going to the winter dance. Um, Jed? Yep. Um, never mind. Uh, so, I'll see you then? I'd like that. Cool. Um, I'll bring in your door at six or something? Sure, and we can work in English in the meantime. 
Yeah, um, like maybe before dinner, if you're not busy. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. Cool. <laughs> hey, Oliver. Yeah? Thanks for the other day when Miss Remy was late. It meant a lot. Yeah, sure. Hi, Miss Remy. <laughs> hi, Mom. Oh, uh, hi, hi, JD. I'm, I'm really glad you're home. Yeah, it's good to be back. What are you reading? Oh, it's 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 just a book a colleague of mine recommended to me. It's um, it's about. Swedish architecture in the 70s and it's really interesting and I didn't think that I would have time for it because I thought I would be busy doing work but then I wasn't actually that's not true I was kind of busy and but I had a really productive day and so I read it and I just remembered how it was something that I used to love and I used to do every day and oh god I'm rambling I'm I'm sorry JD I I I haven't I haven't stopped thinking about the other night and how I treated you like that I I don't know. I don't know what came over me. I, I should have never, 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 never yelled at you. I, I am so incredibly sorry. And you have every right to be upset with me. God knows I deserve it. <laughs> it's okay. I mean, everybody has stressful days. I, I know, sweetie, but that's no excuse. I, I'm sorry. It's okay, Mom. JD, what, what did we ever do to deserve you? I find myself asking that question every day. Oh, Vincent, how is the songwriting going, honey? And also, thank you for doing the dishes and putting in the laundry. I really do appreciate it quite a lot. Well, you know, uh, it's, it's the least I could do. I was... Um, I was having a little bit of writer's block, and uh, I just needed that little bit of inspiration before... Oh. <laughs> I'm so excited to hear it, Dad. Well, thanks for the, for the moral support, Pumpkin. You know, kiddo, I feel like I haven't seen you all week. How's it going? It's going well. I had that presentation for Miss Remy today. That was today? Oh, Goodness, I completely forgot about that. You must have been working on that thing for at least the past month or so. How was it? It went great. Jay, that's wonderful. I'm so proud of you. Yeah, Miss Remy came to me after class and said, this is the best work you've done for my class this year. I'm really proud of you, Jade. Jay, that's amazing. That, that's a really big deal. <laughs> Thanks, guys. I'm finally starting to feel that I have a place here. Honey, I I know the transition's been rough, you know. Your your dad and I are still trying to figure out how to adjust to all these changes and I am I'm sorry that we've been so distanced, but you know what what will never change is how much we uh, love each other and how much we love you. <laughs> okay. I love you too. You know, I feel that we're going to have a great rest of the year. We're going to make it great. I don't go. <laughs> Orton, would you please stop acting like a savage? Oh, really, Claire? Really? <laughs> That question. Jade, answer. What do you think of this line? I heard you singing it on a dream I had a couple days ago. I'm an outsider, outside of everything. Hey, you know, that's, that's pretty good. <laughs> 